In this video, we're going to go over basic automations and we're going to create a simple rule on this board. So on this board, I have some tasks in the backlog here. And what I'm going to want to do is when I move it to done, I want to mark the task complete automatically. So to do that, I'm going to add an automation in the automation section on the left hand side here of the board. I'm going to click into there. In the top right corner, I'm going to create a new automation. So you have some fields here to choose from the automation name, which is the rule name here. You can basically customize that to whatever you want that's descriptive for you. We have a trigger, and this is the event that happens in Rindle that's going to fire this rule. So adding a signee is a perfect example. When you add a signee, this rule will fire, right? And then you have an action. What action will occur when this event fires? Then you can enable the automation. By default, it's disabled. So you want to enable it if you want it active, and then you save the rule. So we're going to create a basic rule, and we're going to go ahead and say, when moved to done, mark the task complete. Okay, then I'm going to select a trigger. So I'm going to drop down this list here. We have lots of triggers available. So I'm going to select the move task. I can actually search in this field. So I'm going to go search for move. So I can select moved or added task. And then I can select the list. So I want to select done. So when it gets moved to the done list, I want this to execute. And then in the action, what action should occur here? I'm going to select the drop down menu. Lots of actions to choose from again. I'm going to mark this complete. So I'm going to search for mark. It'll pull it up, a mark task complete. And now I have my trigger and my action. I can also add conditions, which are a little more advanced. But if you want to get a little more granular with your rule, you can. So you can do things like title contains, specific information, and lots of other things to choose from here. OK, then I'm going to enable my rule. And I'm going to save it. So from there, I'm going to go back to tasks. So I'm going to go ahead and move the task to done. And it's going to mark the task complete automatically. 